funding for AI Gamora is promoted, I. Report a claim. Pay your bill. Safety's mobile app is just one more way we help you manage life's storms. For auto, home, and business, ask your independent agent about safety insurance. And by contributions to your PBS station for viewers like you. Thank you. Here we go, viewers at home, it's showtime, and today we're back with another episode of Quiz Show. This time, it's when the third face-off of the quarterfinals, but the second one in the quarterfinals, the third rematch of high school Quiz Show history, it's Chelmsford taking on Newton North. This is when Lions meet Tigers. So here we go. It all begins with the toss-up round. And this is the only round with no point deductions for any wrong answers. So here we go. Let's play quiz show. Immediately, uh, I wanted to push. Immediately following the historic Brexit vote to leave the European Union, what British currency fell to its lowest level since 1985? Louis the Pound. First question taken by Newton North. <laughs> Was it until 2013 in Mississippi? What constitutional amendment? Did not have time. Was it until 2013 that Mississippi officially ratified what constitutional amendment that banned slavery? The 13th Amendment. Many people in India speak English, a combination of English and what other language? Hindi is the answer to that one. I'm not going to answer all the questions. Dane. Newton North keeps getting all the questions. Judo. Shelmsford hasn't even answered any. Ooh, a king. <gasps> Boy, is this a crown? I don't know. The winner of the Lions versus Tigers match is gonna earn all this treasure. We all know that. Ooh, Peter. Trifold. Ah! Uh, look! Zero points on Chelmsford's score, 50 points on Newton North's. Look. Oh! Anchorfish is correct, there we go. And now Chelmsford is on the point score. After missing out on six questions. Maybe even 10 or 11 or 12. Nah, I'm just kidding. Just stop it. Elsa. Alright, take a look at the monitors. Who's the person? Anna Rothschild. This is gross science. Ew, that's gross, dude. Family may be gross, but it's pretty important for your body. True, it is important for your body. It triggers this uncontrollable act. It's located in the what region that forms the lowest parts of the brain stem. Is it cerebellum? No, it's not. The high brain. No, Mandela oblongata. I never know it. Looking for Alaska? I'm looking for Alaska. Written by whom? John Green. I don't think the Chelmsford Lions have any luck. They only have 20 points. George H. W. Bush, correct. A math question. In the afternoon as in the morning. If you sold a total of 3,360 peaches that day, then how many peaches did you sell in the afternoon? 240 is the answer. <sighs> This doesn't really look like Lions versus Tigers, because Newton North is already at the 100 mark. Chelmsford has not made it yet. Me before you, you before me. Just kidding. We're just here to have some fun. Chile. <laughs> 
Bosnian capital city, Malini, Sharhivo. And now Chelmsford's at the 100 mark and are catching up to the Tigers, the new North team. The younger brother Richard of Shrewsbury were last seen alive in what building? It's the Tower of London. The Silk Road is the answer to this question. Ben, Pluto. Oh! There's the bell ending the round. The score jumps for it high. 110 points. New North, 180 points. Let's make some noise. Huh. Chelmsford and... <gasps> Chelmsford... Wait, wait, wait. The most, the most common is so top of hydrogen. Chelmsford answered hydrogen one. So, it's an acceptable answer. <gasps> Oh, the Lions didn't get disqualified. That means Chelmsford is not disqualified. It is Peter to the right, Louis to the left. Wow, I didn't know there was a score correction for Chelmsford. That's crazy. Although they are still in second place. They can boys in at any time. <laughs> you know... I'm all speech is cool. We're Darwin's cool. Ever wonder if four of these players, or eight of these players rather, would be at the Universal Park? That would be very, very cool. The most successful thing you need to do is get a little bit taller, and then you can fit. Ooh, Victoria Falls. Ooh, I don't know about this anymore. It's not good for Chelmsford, but really good luck for Newton North. How come they're not at the 200 mark? Huh? Bill O'Reilly, there we go! I don't think Chelmsford is going to make it before the head-to-head -head round is all done. We have to skip a few minutes, too. What U.S. state is nicknamed the Tar Heel State, North Carolina? And that ends round two. The score, Chelmsford High School, 140 points. New North High, 210 points. Let's make some noise for both teams. Uh. If anyone wants to watch the STEM teacher video challenge from these beautiful kids, then check it out. Skip a few minutes. Cool. Whoa. Newton North is already at the 300 mark, and Chelmsford hasn't even reached the 200 mark. I think it's a runaway game. You know, you know, Paris from Newton North would ever kick a soccer ball, right? Pop quiz to boldly go, huh? I completely chose the wrong question. What national mission successfully fulfilled President Kennedy's vision of a man on the moon before the end of the decade? Apollo 11, that's correct. Come on, they're so close to the 200 mark. Chelmsford answers this question. They're in the 200 mark. However, they will still be in second place. The, ah, the question's taken by Isabella. Darn it! Oh, there we go. Sputnik 1 was launched on October 4th, 1957. It stayed in the orbit for which of the following? A, three days, B, three months, or C, is it still in space? Three days? Oh! Three months? Whew! And finally, Chelmsford is in the 200 mark. I was hoping that would happen sooner, but... They are still in second place, however, but that's good. On the surface of a distant comet, what is it? Nothing, I guess. Rosetta? Cool. 
Harry Potter share what birthday? July 31st, the very last day of July. We're going to fight the power, 30 points at stake. Polarizing movie that drew both praise and condemnation when Kentucky Clark was jailed in 2015 to preferring to issue marriage license for to gay couples. It is Kim Davis. And now, oh! Wait a minute. It, oh, I had one more question! But that ends the category round. Chelmsford right now, 310 points. Newton North, 560 points. Wow! Okay. We know we can cheer on Tigers, but we also want to cheer on Lions. And now we're heading into the final round of play, the lightning round. Incorrect answers cost you 20. Correct answers earn you 20. Who are the class commissioner number murder on the Ordnance Express? Peter. Christy Agna Christy. Peter 3. The Mayor of the Mist is a famous boat tour of what natural wonder? Nigeria Falls. Um, I'm not going to read all these questions. David Bowie. Who is David Bowie? Is he my best partner? Probably no. The buck stops here. The very same custom of designing mountings. Ooh, Chelmsford, is he gonna make it? Yes, they did! But Newport is at the 600 mark, Chelmsford at the 400 mark. They're doing pretty good, but is in second place. Ah! Uh, they're knocked out. They knocked out, they got knocked out at the 400 mark. Can they come back? No! No! William Shakespeare died on April 23 of 1595. No, 1660. What's the state capital of Delaware? Dover! And that's the end of the game. The winning team this week is Newton North with 620 points. Jumps for this week, 370 points. How about it? Let's congratulate both teams with a great round. Wow. And I'll catch you later, viewers at home. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to join the viewers at home. Smash that like button if you enjoyed the video. And don't forget to leave a comment about other high school quiz show videos I should watch. Anyway, though, this is Virtual WGBH Kids Guy and Dragonfly signing off. Kados! Funding for AI Guitar is provided by. Report a claim. Pay your bill. Safety's mobile app is just one more way we help you manage life's storms. For auto, home, and business, ask your independent agent about safety insurance. And by contributions to PBS station for viewers like you.